When I'm working with my clients, some of them ask me, really, do I have any say in what I do on a day in and day out basis within my franchise? And the short answer is yes. Now franchises come in many different flavors and different styles, but also different maturity levels. We break out franchises in three areas. You have emerging brands, which are brand new franchises that may have four or five or six brands that are just getting started within in going to the market. The next are growth brands, where you may be the first owner within your region, but there's 40, 50 other brands throughout the United States. Then we have mature brands, and those mature brands have been around for a long time and are very solid and consistent and, quite frankly, tight operating systems and models. So when you're operating a franchise model, what are you buying? You're buying a proven system, and I liken it to having a path. An emerging brand has a fairly wide path with, net, with low guardrails for you to operate your business within that path. A growth brand, the, the path is a little narrower and the guardrails are a little higher, but you still have a lot of freedom and flexibility to work and execute against a plan. However, if you're in a mature brand, that's a very narrow path and very high guardrails, and you're really executing specifically against their plan. Depending on the level of input that you want to have and the level of influence you want to have will depend on the type of brand that you actually acquire.